I'm Rosie and I'm the War Manager for Jade Ward here at Langley Green. Um, I've been in this role for a year and a half now and prior to that I was um, briefly at Millview as a practice development nurse and prior to that I was in the community um, within early intervention. My job is like really, really broad from um, doing shifts in the numbers. Um, I guess a big part of my job is making sure that my staff are okay and that everyone's feeling okay. I think it's one thing kind of driving a big recruitment but then retaining staff and supporting them and ensuring that supervision stays high and um, we run on, on, on kind of a lead leader model here so ensuring that people feel fulfilled within their role and they've got things to do and, and things to lead on and yeah we, we kind of I think there's a, there's a real flattened hierarchy here and I think that's something we're really proud of. I think you've got to practice what you preach. I think it's one thing um, being a leader and saying, you know, you need to do this and this is this is good care, but um, unless some people see that role modelled, then sometimes it's quite hard to see. Um, I think um, always having kind of my door open to support people when they need to just come in for a chat or just to offload or to kind of find solutions to things. Um, I think sometimes being a good leader, it was about seeing things as a team and, and almost kind of not looking at you, it's about looking at your team and what they need. So, you know, ensuring that we've got our away days every three months, that we've always got training available, that um, we've got lead roles on the ward, you know, there is definitely a flattened hierarchy with, with us doing shifts and the numbers as leaders, but also, um, you know, everyone sharing the audits and putting value into the things that people are doing. Um, you've, you've, I think you need to have, you know, a good balance between being able to be serious and boundaried at times, but also having, you know, mini friendships with your team and, and being a, you know, a, pers a human person, really. I love all the like feminist stuff that's around and pro women, but I think we need to really focus on keeping things equal. And and sometimes it's important not to differentiate. Um, I think um, never to forget your voice and to always stand up um, for what you believe in and to kind of hold your integrity. Um, I guess it's about having that confidence to perhaps sit in a room of men and to still you know know and believe that your your point is just as valid and being able to get that across. I think it's about um, staying true to, to who you are um, and you know, I remember when I first became a fan six in London and you'd get people saying like I want to speak to the, one of the child nurses and I'd come down and they'd be like you're the child nurse <laughs> but oh, that used to make me thrive, that used to push me to kind of go further. It sounds really cliche but I meet inspirational women all the time and I think it's really important not just to focus on those ones that are, that are famous or you know. I have to look at those women around me and um, my family you know I think I definitely you know I definitely look at my auntie she's a CEO and she's we're quite similar and being quite headstrong and independent and, and kind of doing what we want, I guess, um, within reason. Well, yeah, all my all my girlfriends and my you know my mom and um, I massively have my my mom. She works um, with my dad and and she's she, you know she's the admin side of, of of the of the job, but that the business wouldn't survive without her. And she's um, she's yeah she's pretty incredible. I, I think it's nice to look at the, the the fun side of role models as well. Like, Without my car singing on the way to Crawley from Brighton to Beyonce, I don't think I'd be here. I don't think I'd be as girl powerish, you know. The fun side of, of women figures and, and Spice Girls and, you know, all the things from, from my childhood that I remember. But, you know, it's just about what makes you feel good, isn't it?